Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the network error code 0x800704b3. The network path was either typed incorrectly, does not exist, or the network provider is not currently available. Please try retyping the path or contact your network administrator. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys, on how to resolve it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in troubleshoot. Best result, check it back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. And now on the right side, underneath options, you want to select other troubleshooters. And then underneath most frequent, select the network and internet troubleshooter and the corresponding run button. And then follow along with the on-screen prompts here about going ahead and actually suggesting how to resolve the problem. So again, if you're not connected, it should start walking through different troubleshooting diagnostic utilities within this window here. So again, that'd be the first thing I recommend doing. Something else, if you want to open up the search menu and type in CMD, best result, should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And then into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by a space, forward slash, scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take a couple minutes to run, so please be patient. Once that is concluded, go ahead and type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter. Should come back a Windows IP configuration to successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to type in NETSH space WINSOC, W-I-N-S-O-C-K, space reset. Again, exactly how you see it on my screen. And then hit enter. Should come back with successfully reset the Winsock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. Close out of here and then restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this point of issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.